Hi, I'm Judy Cliburn and I represent you in the 41st District. Thanks for joining me for another update on our work here in the legislature. This week I want to talk about a topic on the minds of many people, the economic stimulus package being discussed in Washington, D.C. and how it would impact our state's transportation projects. While transportation isn't the only focus of the stimulus, it will play a really big part. I've been in touch with our federal officials and I know they are focused on a package that creates jobs and helps turn our economy around in a positive direction. To do this, they're looking at funding projects that can break ground within 180 days. These would be use it or lose it funds. So they're working hard to identify projects that qualify and that are truly ready to go so that the money won't be lost by delays. The Washington State Department of Transportation as well as local governments across the state have worked hard to come up with projects that meet the intentions of the stimulus package. Most of them are small like paving and maintenance which can be done quickly. Larger projects will be included too but there are fewer of those because they require longer planning periods. It's hard to give specific examples right now because the terms and the structure of the stimulus package are still being worked out in Washington, D.C. Last week, the U.S. House passed a version, and this week, the Senate will begin its debate. We expect, uh, we expect the package to come together in the next few weeks and to receive funds towards the end of February or the middle of March here in Washington State. Between our original transportation construction plans and the new projects from the stimulus, this spring and summer will be the largest transportation construction season ever. Expect to see crews all over the state making great progress towards improving our infrastructure so that people and goods can move more efficiently. Join me in a couple of weeks for a new update and please contact my office if you ever have a question or a concern. Thanks for watching.